Are we ready? We're good? Hey, I'm uh, Apples McIntosh. I'm the uh, number one assistant golf professional at uh, Chilliwack Golf Club. How do I prepare for the Chilliwack Open? Well, I like to get a good night's sleep the night before so I wake up nice and refreshed. Competitive golf is something I take really seriously and success in it is inevitable when, I, when opportunity needs preparation. I treat my body as a temple, so the key to my pre-round prep is a nice hearty meal. I like to be nourished and ready for the day. Because of the athlete that I am, I like to get a nice solid warm up before my round. I'll generally come about two hours ahead of time, warm up, stretch, and make sure my body's loose for the entire day. I'd say I'm more confident and cocky in my short game. Realistically, anything inside 100 yards is my go zone area, and I'm probably going to make one to hole out one to two of those around. After my short game warm up, generally what I'll do is I'll go out to the driving range and I'll start stretching a little bit, making sure my back is loose, my hips are loose. I don't want to get into any trouble, any injury trouble on the golf course. I want to be ready to go and all set. When I start warming up, generally I'll start with driver. It's a little bit unconventional, but I feel like that separates me from the competition. Once I'm all ready to go and my warm-up's done, what I'll tend to do is find a nice quiet spot in the clubhouse somewhere, spend about 10 to 15 minutes just meditating and getting my mind mentally ready for the entire day. With my pre-game preparation, I think it's virtually impossible that I go out and shoot anything worse than a 69 on any given day. Now on the tee from Ottawa, Ontario, Colin McIntosh. Yeah, you can do it.